today we're going to change spark plugs on this car. We're going to make it pretty simple, just spark plugs. I'm going to show you how to do it, add a little bit of anti-seize, boom, right back on. Uh, we're going to do stuff little by little, and each video is going to be something different. We're going to do the wires after that. You know, we're probably going to, the oil cap, <laughs> any cap, air filter, just basic stuff. P people want to see basic stuff. Just get it done, boom, that's it. So let's start with removing the wires. It was pretty awesome. Uh, now that I remove all plugs, I removed them in order. So if you could see, last, third, second, and first. Um, I was gonna buy NGK wires. Uh, previous owner said they had just bought some wires for it. The car was just sitting for a while, and uh... yeah. So look at that. It has NGK wires. So just saved myself. About 50 bucks on NGK wires. So, time to remove. Five eighths. Has a magnet inside. What? <laughs> Yo, this is on there real tight. That's bad. That shouldn't be on that on there tight. Uh, normally the way I do it is I hand twist first, you know, once I feel uh, that I can't no more, then I grab the ratchet and I just do about a little bit of that turn and that's it. You don't got to tighten these all the way. Now you don't. Uh, uh. Wow, that was on there really, really, that was just, um, now they do smell a lot like gas. They still look pretty good. Uh, it's a lot of, hmm. But yeah, I didn't like the way that was on there, so. But either way, new car, new daily car, just new plugs, why not? Eh. And let's just do the rest. And. Damn. Uh, ever wonder what that's for? Over this, these plugs, they already come gapped. So it just helps it from damaging. See how it just stops? Tap, 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 tap. A yep. little bit of anti-seize. You want to apply the threads. You just want to apply a little bit and just, just spread it. Just spread, 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 spread. So like I said, pretty simple process. We're going to... Apply this plug into the magnet there, and then we're gonna slide it down and then hand thread. So we'll do that first. Yeah, it makes it easier with a magnet and plug. See, so now it's just for you to slide in, zoop, and uh, do, 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 do. slide in. We're gonna find the what well, there's on. Just gonna start spinning. So you gotta keep twisting till it's. Stops with your hand. Remember, with your hand, you're not gonna damage anything with your hand. Not that strong. So you know, just do check all plugs. This is where you grab your ratchet. Mm -hmm. From there, we're just gonna slightly turn. So we're gonna slightly turn. See, that's it. That's all I'm doing. Start from right here. Slightly turn. That's it. And that's the last plug. So spark plugs are done. They're good. It's not that hard, believe me. On these four cylinder cars, it's not that hard. Anyone who has a Civic, you're looking to do this real easy. Uh, remember, I used, used a 5 uh spark plug drive. Now, you could use any 5 eighths. Um, this, this has a magnet, so I was able to lift it. If you don't, you have to grab a magnet and you, you pull that thing out. Now, I have a long extension. makes it easier to work on. And obviously, it's a 3-8 drive, so 3-8 ratchet. Uh, any ratchet will work. Does, doesn't